grain terminal project at the Port of Oshawa is uh, part of a larger $35 million investment. We use the expertise that HOPA has in managing engineering and heavy civil projects to help us uh, construct this terminal, which will address the demands of the growing need for uh, grain exports in southern Ontario. Our primary goal here is to give farmers a secondary option in southern Ontario where to bring their grain. QSL is a key supply chain player in North America. We have operations in Canada and the U.S. This expansion is allowing us to do is to receive trucks and load vessels faster and it also allows us to load larger ships. Our terminal has been designed to uh, efficiently run at uh, 700 metric tons per hour. Typical unloading times per truck once they reach the receiving pit is less than 10 minutes. In addition to that, we have the capability to vessel load up to 12,000 metric tons of grain per day. Grain testing, when we're talking about vessels, is done by an internationally recognized surveyor. Truckers typically, the, the way that they would unload uh, grain at the Port of Oshawa would be to first go to our probing station. Once the, the grain is approved for uh, export, they will enter the port, come into our scale house, get scaled, and then make their way onto the truck unloading station. Uh, from there, their short 10 minute unload. With the terminal strategic location, we're looking at cutting down 12,000 heavy truck trips on the local highways. One of the things that we you know, strive for is to reduce carbon emissions. This facility is it's an excellent uh, way of doing that for you know, the local farming community. It shortens the travel time to deliver the grain. It was a great joy to see the first trucker roll in with our test load. The feedback has been very positive. Transport companies and local elevators are happy coming here. It's efficient, it's fast. We're really proud that we're able to create a place where local farmers can bring their grain for export instead of having to truck many, many kilometers to other sites in Ontario. We had reliability and consistency in mind, and I think that's gonna, that's gonna prove to be very true over the next few years as farmers uh, experience how it is to unload grain at the Port of Washington.